Hi. Um, so you said that you were a B and C student and you went to Hamilton College, right? Yes. Is this even working? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hamilton College. Um, and, so, and then you talked about the liberal arts education taking a wide array of classes. Um, do you have any advice for how, how one could relate a liberal arts education to the outside world or the things like, like how would you have, did you relate the classes, the things you were studying to the, the projects you wanted to do a lot? And, and then what you did after, do you feel like your liberal arts education was very relevant to what you were? You're gonna be very, very uh, uh, sad you asked that, which you, I'm gonna really unload here. I think the liberal arts education is phenomenal. I look back and that was the smartest thing that I ever did was uh, get that education. Um, the preparation, the things that I do every day as an entrepreneur is figure things out. Uh, tell the difference between whether someone is bullshitting me or has a reasonable argument. Convincing people that my point of view is a reasonable one. Bringing people along with me. Um, all these skills that uh, doing research and synthesize, synthesizing what are the real points here? What's, hist what's been done before? Why did it succeed? Why did it fail? That's what you do every day as an entrepreneur and that may sound similar to these po apparently pointless exercises you may feel like you're doing here. But it's amazing that being able to make an argument and defend an argument and to be able to detect bullshit and to be able to go and look for real sources so that you're getting unbiased information. That is so rare and so valuable. Um, there's two courses that I thought were the best courses I took. Um, and now I'll, I'll wade into dangerous territory because I don't, but one of course was all the composition stuff that I did, all the writing. Um, I write a lot now. And it all came from being able to recognize what great writing was, what compelling writing was, what powerful writing was. And that came from having teachers who beat the crap out of me um, and got all my bad habits out. And the other class, and I use that every day and I thank them for that. And the other one was my public speaking class. That was unbelievably useful. Uh, and I mean, and so that, now here I'm gonna preach. I think everybody should um, do that. And worse, and now you say, this is why you, you have to regret that you asked the question. It surprises me that people are required to write a 25 page paper, but not equally required to make a one hour to do what I did about the uh, meaning of Ulysses and how it translates. That would be unbelievably valuable for somebody, and maybe equally valuable as writing the 25 page paper. So I'm a big fan. <laughs>